Hey YouTube, this is Tony B from TonyBTV.com and uh, today we're just going to show you how to uh, remove a uh, watermark from uh, from an image just using uh, Windows Paint. Um, it shouldn't take very long and uh, it's so easy anybody can do it. So let's get started. You want to just open up uh, the uh, picture that you want to import. So I'm going to open this up in uh, in print. I mean in paint. And let's see. Let's let's do one uh, that won't take so much time. All right, you want to scroll out so you can see. All right, so let's do this icon here. Oops, Control Z takes that away. So look, this is a quick and easy one, but this is just to give you an idea on how simple it is. You just Control Copy, and uh, over here you. Uh, this one I did before, but uh, I didn't finish. And uh, we can show you how to finish this one too. So you just Control V and you paste it, and uh, and then you just line it up, and make it even, and uh, and there you go. That's about that. That's about even, and uh, that's it. So you just click in there, now it's posted in there. So now you just simply want to zoom in and uh, watch, watch how easy this is. You just bing bang. And uh, for this you just, you just copy this. Now it's a little tricky because you see there's a little line that, that's running down. Control V to paste. So you want to bring that right up. You don't want to go there. You want to go right there. And, uh, and then you want to do that one too. Okay, and voila, perfect. Now for this, you just want to hit the uh, the eyedropper and grab that color that the bar is. Then you want to scroll here, make the pencil as small as possible, and. Uh, you just want to follow it down and this is just drawing by pixel one pixel at a time now you want to do a little bit at a time because if you screw up then you'll have you know like if I go like this and I didn't save it I have this when I had to go control Z to, I, I, I lose a lot so see you want to always click a little bit and unclick, click a little bit and unclick. I see like that was a mess up. Control Z fixes it. And there you see I click it all the way down. And you just run it all the way down. Now, for this, you just want to grab the uh, the eyedropper again and grab that color. It's a little shade off. And uh, for that, and then you just do the same thing. You just open, drag with the left mouse and let go. Drag and let go. See, I made a mistake. Control Z fixes it. 
and then, and then you just bring it down. Oops. See, like that, control Z fixes it. And of course, I'm a perfectionist. I mean, you don't really have to be that, you know, but if you really want it to look, this takes the watermark away completely. Uh, you see no trace of the watermark when I'm finished. There's zero trace of it. And this just cleans out the white area. So now you just want to look, clear up any little junk that you see laying around. Make sure that there's no more watermark there. And um, And yeah, that looks great. Now that side is done. Now you can see it's perfect. And now I'm going to remove the watermark on the other side. So the same process. And of course, you could do this with any image. I'm just showing you an easy image. The harder the image, obviously, the longer the time. So this is an easy image. Just for, uh, for here, I'm showing you a simple image. And uh, you just copy, control, copy. Control V to paste it, and you just uh, for this you can even stretch it out and just bring it across one time, and uh, boom, it's gone. And the same with this, you just want to select this, boom, it's gone, and then for the inside, you want to highlight that. Oh, you see, that was a mess, so control V. We wanted to get all of it out without getting the brown, I mean the gray. And uh, look at that. And that's uh, complete. That's completely uh, done. It didn't take that long at all. Um, so that's how you uh, remove a watermark using uh, Microsoft Paint. Uh, this is Windows 7, but it w it'll work on any any Microsoft Paint will uh, will work uh, to remove the uh, the watermarks. Now, of course, you're supposed to remove the watermarks on your image. Uh, if they're not your image, you're not supposed to remove the watermark. This is just for uh, for your own image to remove the uh, watermark for yourself and um, so it's just simply takes about 10 minutes like that and if it was you know a little bit more detail you know obviously it would be a little harder but uh, there's a lot of different tricks uh, that you can do and um, maybe I'll show you one more being that that was so so fast. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's just show you this method here. I'm not going to do the whole all all of them, but just say you wanted to uh, quickly. Uh, you wanted to quickly get this image removed. You just clear one side like this. You uh, you just control copy, control V. You bring that there and. Uh, You know, you can do that on one shot. Uh, what did I do? <laughs> Control V. You want to line that up there, bring that, and then just drag it across there like that. And that's done. Now, and the same thing over here. 
you want to highlight and you just want to get rid of that so now that's that's all clear now what you can do and up here and over here and for over here you can just you can just go copy control V and you just drag that up there like that and that's it and zoom in a little closer to make sure that you yeah you see like uh, those little things there you just go down and bingo all gone man now to save the time you just uh, you go like this I thought I wasn't recording, but I am. <laughs> control copy, control V. And you just you just uh negate it. So you flip horizontal and uh you just line it up like that. And uh, and there you go. I look, it couldn't couldn't be any faster than that. Now for this, you just uh, you just do the copy and uh, copy and paste and There's a little tiny bit there, so you got to go in real small to get these. Photoshop actually has a little bit more of a better zoom. Um, now this, you just want to you want to hit the eyedropper, grab that color, make sure you have it at the smallest, and uh, and then that you just want to whoops. No, you just want to, oh, what, a, what happened? This goes over here. Oh, my God, I made a bobo. Nobody's perfect. I got the wrong color here. Yeah. All right. And there you go. And then for this one, you want to get the eyedropper again. And you just fill it in. Oops. See, now as long as you stop, it saves. And there you go. Now, uh, oops, I uh, see, I didn't click, all right, click, click, there you go. Uh, now, let's see, we get this all done in one shot here. And then this one, you just go down. Bada bing, bada bang. And it's perfect every time. Oh, you son of a gun. Hey, look at that. See? Whoops. You just want to do that. Oh, hate when that happens.
and then it's tedious work believe it or not but hey it's worth it if your project is messed up it's the easiest way to uh, to remove the, the the watermark without having to uh, redo the whole project from scratch and there you have it perfect look at that so you couldn't tell that there was ever a watermark on that and uh, you know you could just proceed to do the whole you can do the whole thing it's just uh, just very simple just bang bang so there you have it how to uh, remove a watermark using uh, just Microsoft Paint uh, if you like what you see and you want some more helpful temp tips like this hit me up on YouTube at uh, TonyBTV.com uh, subscribe and uh, tell me the comments below on what you think and uh, let me know what you guys want uh, me to do for you and uh, we'll set these videos up and uh, we're self-taught it took us uh, a whole life to learn all these different little tricks and uh, we love sharing them with uh, with everybody out here so uh, hit me up on uh, on Twitter at uh, DJ underscore Tony B and uh, Facebook uh, at uh, DJ uh, Tony B TV live uh, DJ Tony B TV live on Facebook and uh, Instagram it's DJ Anthony B so I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, we'll talk to you soon peace out